Hi guys! Okay, so I hope you're all having a really good day. It's almost Friday, so that's good. Except this is my spring break, so it's kind of sad that it's almost over. But if you work, it's good. Um, so, <laughs> why are you staring at me? <laughs> Alright guys, so um, to start my video off, I'm going to go ahead and do a application for you and I'm gonna do layering um, with different colors so the nice thing about lip sense is it's unlike normal lipsticks you can layer different colors and you can make your own color combinations so with the um, the cool thing is with three co different colors since there's three layers you can do each layer different color and you can have up to 27 different color combinations and um, so yeah, so that's pretty cool. Today I'm just gonna layer two colors. I'm gonna layer Mold Wine, that's what that looks like, and Sheer Berry. That's that one. So this, um, these are my two favorites right now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna use Mold Wine first, but I'm gonna start um, by cleansing my lips. So I'm gonna use the Meissler Cleansing Water and I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse or clean my lips and make sure that they're clean and dry. So people also use um, witch hazel. The one thing about witch hazel is it can be harsh for your lips, so it can dry them out and you don't want to use it um, more than twice a week if you do end up getting that. You can get it off Amazon if you'd like. Um, I just use this one because it's not as harsh. So my lips are clean and dry now. So I'm gonna go ahead and start by shaking up mold wine. And I'm gonna use one, um, one layer of mold wine and then two layers of sheer berry. So you go ahead and just wipe off all the excess on the tube. And you wanna go in one direction. And now you share it, right? I'm going to go ahead and shake that one. Sorry, my eyes are here. And the last layer. Hi, Garrett. And now I feel it in my glossy glass. And I let it dry a little. My brother's dancing in the background. You want to dance for the people? All right, so I got it outside of my lips a little bit because I'm a mess, guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and use my oops remover, and I'm going to sit there and rub the parts that I got it out on. If 
there were ever parts of your lips that you, um, like your actual lip, that you wanted to get the um, color off of, you want to go ahead and remove all of your gloss first so that it's easier for you to remove. So I fixed that now. So this is how mold, um, one layer of mold wine and two sheer berry look. I have something on my mouth, guys. So that's what that looks like. I love it. I love that you can layer colors. Because I haven't gotten a color yet that I don't like because I've been able to layer them with other colors. So, yeah, if um, that's why, yeah, I just love this product, guys. So um, now I have a couple of announcements for you guys. Um, I made, I ended up making a YouTube channel, and so far I just have all of my lives on there. Um, but I might actually do like YouTube videos, maybe we'll see. And um, you can actually do lives on there, I guess. So maybe I'll end up doing that. But my YouTube channel is just under. Gabby, stop <laughs> laughing at me. My YouTube channel is just under my name. Um, I'll actually put a link on the on this group after I'm done with this so you guys can visit it if you'd like and subscribe um, also today is or tomorrow is the last day to get 15% off because it's the end of my first month as a distributor because we made it a whole month yay <laughs> um, hopefully it will make it a lot more so um, so yeah so today I'm gonna go ahead and do swatches of all my available colors because yeah, tomorrow's the last day for the 15% off for March. And um, here we go. Um, even though tomorrow's the last day for the 15% off, there's always a 100% guarantee. So if you're not ready to buy it yet, don't worry, you can still buy it whenever you're ready. And you can get, it's a 100% satisfaction guarantee. If you're not happy with it, you can return it. I can get you a new color if you'd like or you can get your money back, it's up to you. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do swatches of all my colors that I have available, it's slash in my own personal stock. And so I'm gonna start with um, the lip senses and I'm just gonna go ahead and do them on my arm because I have the most of these. I'm gonna take my watch off real quick. So I'll start with like the nude colors. So for nudes I have Bravo, Bay Champagne, Mm. Um, Praline Rose, Dawn Rising, and Precious Topaz. That's all you have in your stuff? Oh, so, these are my new. So I'm going to go ahead and do those. I'm going to start with Bravo because it's my lightest color. I'm just going to go I ahead. I have that today with beige champagne. Not really pretty. In the, if you saw my lot, um, not my life my running video earlier my mom was wearing this color and she wore three of these three layers of this and she layered it um then with one layer of beige champagne so you can do as many layers as you want you just have to have as at least three so we're gonna go ahead and start with bravo. my mom did four because she thought bravo was too light so we're gonna go ahead and just do It is a really light color. If you're into nudes, you like light colors, this will be perfect for you. Um, next, while I'm waiting for that one to dry, I'm gonna do Praline Rose. That's the next lightest, I think. Praline Rose is so pretty. I think this one's my favorite nude. It's my sister's favorite. She refuses to get in my video even though she's wearing it. She's wearing it. That's Gabby, everyone. Thanks for joining us. Right, and then, Face Champagne, I think, is the next lightest. So I'm gonna go ahead, this one's Face Champagne. You guys just ate. Look at all the other one. Have any of you guys seen Beauty and the Beast? 
I'm seriously obsessed with it. I just saw it a couple days ago. It was so good. Why are you laughing? <laughs> I was a serious question. Alright, this is Dawn Rising. If you have but if you haven't seen Beauty and the Beast, I totally I definitely what is the word? Would recommend would recommend watching it because it's so good. Dawn Rising. This is the one I wore today in my running video. Stayed on so great. Lasted so much longer than me during my run. <laughs> so next I'm gonna do precious topaz. That's this is what that looks like. Precious Topaz is so pretty too. It's not as nude as these other ones. I'm just gonna group it up with the nudes though because I don't want it to be in its own little group. All right, so while those dry, I'm gonna do my second layer of all these now. So we'll start with Bravo again. Again. I'll post a picture of all of these after too, so you guys can see it. I'll show you in the video too, but just in case. Face champagne. Dawn Rising. And precious topaz. I'm trying to work on my swatches, guys, so they're better for you. <laughs> so, bravo again. Getting a little better at them. They're not as. What's it called? Lopsided as they normally are. Praline Rose. Is it raspberry? Dawn Rising. And precious tips. So while I'm doing this, I'm just gonna remind you guys all of these. The individual colors are $25. But um, for your first order, you'll want to order the collection kit. So the collection kit comes with oh the collection kit comes sorry with the color the um, oops remover to take it off, and the glossy gloss, which I cannot, did you steal my glossy gloss? And the glossy gloss. This is not yours. It's not yours. <laughs> All right. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put glossy gloss on these swatches. I think this is hers. I brought mine out here. Gabby! So these are all of the swatches. So I'm gonna go ahead. So the top one's Bravo, then Praline Rose, Bay Champagne, Dawn Rising, and Precious Topaz. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the reds and the berries I have. It's not. So, I'm going to do reds and berries. So, what's hers? Okay. 
<laughs> it was hers. I'm sorry, Gavin. This one's blue red. evil eye. I'm gonna have swatches all down my arm, guys. Because I have a lot of stock for you guys. Fly Girl. It's another red. It's not as bright as blue red. Blue red is the brightest red, um, but it's also the most popular. And now for my berries. I have Napa. This one's, um, I think this one's the brightest berry. It's not the darkest though, if that makes sense. And then Sheer Berry. The reds are definitely the most pigmented pigmented colors. If you needed a um, a lip liner for any of these colors, it'd probably be the reds. Um, but instead of we do have lip liners available, I just use the tip to line my lips because since it's like a liquid lipstick applicator, it's pretty easy to just line your lips with the applicator. And then this one's mold wine. You gotta have just enough arm space for all these. All right, so now we're gonna do blue red again. Put the second layer on. Okay, my swatches are getting a little messy, guys. It's okay. You can still kind of. Those all of them? Yeah, these are. These are all of the lip senses I have. If there is a color that you're waiting for, you can go ahead and message me or go ahead and just comment on here. And if I might have it coming on the way, I do have some coming in, a, in tomorrow and like in a couple days. Um, so if it's one of those, perfect. I'll send it out to you when I get it. If it's not, I can wait for it for you and I'll order it once it comes in. I'm sure, baby. Because I, I definitely know that it can be, um, with this out of stock issue, it can be um, kind of disappointing if your color's not, the color you want is not available. Because I know I've been waiting for Plum forever, and that one hasn't been available yet. But it's okay, because I have all of these. Dry, dry, dry. All right, so now the last layer of all these, so blue red again. I thought this was gonna be a short video. I didn't think it would take me this long to do the swatches. Right. And then fly girl. Napa. Napa's my mom's favorite color. I honestly think it's mine too. I love Napa. It's so pretty. Because it's a berry, but it's not dark. It's not too dark. So if you're, if you like berries, but you're kind of hesitant on trying them out, I definitely try Napa or Sheerberry before mold wine because mold wine is a much darker color than those two. Sheer berry is a really pretty berry as well. It's like it's more natural than both Napa and mold wine. Now we're gonna seal all of those in with glossy gloss. I don't know why I always want to shake the glossy gloss. You do not have to shake the glossy gloss. You can if you want to. Alright so I'm just gonna seal all these in.
I'm sorry, I am so bad at swatches, guys. If these are so ugly when I show them to you, please don't judge me. I tried. All right, so now I'm gonna show you these ones. So these are the reds and the berries. So the top one is blue red, and then fly girl, sheer, just kidding, Napa, sheer berry, and then mold wine. So the swatch for sheer berry, brown but it's not brown I'm wearing it right now with the mold wine on the bottom and it's it's definitely a berry color it's not brown I don't know why it's appearing kind of brown on there so um, now I'm gonna go ahead and do swatches of the glosses I have just hopefully you guys can see them I'll do them on the other side of my arm um, so I have sand gloss Orchid gloss, I love orchid, it's so pretty. Rose gloss, and obviously glossy gloss. This is the one that will come with your kit, if um, that you want to seal in all of your colors with as well, because this is the most moisturizing of all the glosses, and it just makes your lips feel so good, and it'll seal your color in the best. And then we also have matte gloss. So I don't have matte gloss in stock right now, but I have extras coming. So I just ordered some extras because I ran out. So I'm gonna do sand gloss first. These are gonna be so hard for you guys to see, so I'm trying to make them a little bit thicker. And you can just put any of these glosses over your color and it'll add a special tint or color to the lip sense. And then I have scratches all over my arm too because my puppy's teething and she likes to try to eat my arm. But it's okay because I love her anyway. She's lucky, she's so cute. All right, yeah, this is not working, but hopefully you guys can kind of see it. Um, so the top, no, oh, yeah, there's no way. I posted, okay, you can kind of see it, I guess. The one on the right, far right, is sand gloss. It's like um, brown shimmer, and then orchid gloss is next to, to the left of that one. That one is like purplish pink shimmer, and then... The next one next to that is rose gloss, and it's supposed to be like a rose color shimmer. So those are all just extra glosses that you can, you can wear them by themselves as well, but um, most people put them over their lip senses. They would actually be really pretty by themselves. I did a swatch of matte, but it doesn't look like anything. It will just add a matte finish to your lip sense. Oh, all right, and now we're gonna go ahead and do shadow scents little swatches of all the shadow senses I have available. These are not all the shadow senses I have. My shadow senses have actually gone really fast, so I'm just going to go ahead. I have about one to two of each of these extra. So if you want them, please message me ASAP. So this is Garnet. I'm going to do Garnet first. Garnet, it, you can use it on your eyebrows. Um, it's a really dark brown. I also use it as an eyeliner sometimes. I did not do that. I didn't do eyeliner today, but I use it on my eye as my eyeliner in my last video and I love this color. It's our top selling um, shadow scents because you can there's so many different uses for it. Alright, so Garnet is just a dark brown. And then Silver Violet is a really pretty light purple. And then um, Mocha Java is a lighter brown. I use this one in my crease a lot. And this is the cream, not the shimmer. I have the shimmer coming, but I haven't gotten it yet. Snow, it's a white color, and I normally use it as either a lid color or I put it in my corner, the corner of my eye right here, just to open up my eye a little bit. That one is a huge swatch. It's okay. And then Pink Posy. 
this color is so pretty. I was so excited when I got this color. And I normally use this one as um, a lid color as well. And then we have denim, the one my dog chews, my dog's chewed up. <laughs> Sorry, it looks kind of messed up, but it's a navy blue. This color is really pretty too. I love the Shadow Senses. They work so well. All of these products are smudge and waterproof and they will last all day. All right, so these are the Shadow Senses. The top one is Garnet, and then we have Silver Violet, Mocha Java, Snow, Pink Posy, and then Denim on the side right there. It kind of looks black right now, but it's a navy blue. So those are all of the colors I have available. As extras, I also, that are like shadow scents or lip scents, I also have one more blush scent available, and it's Pouty Pink. It's the one I wore in my video yesterday. I feel like I drop you guys every time. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I, oh. So the blush scents in pouty pink. I have one left, and it is a really natural looking blush. I love this color. All right, and then we have the lip volumizer. I also have one more of these. If you've ever felt like, if you've ever wanted bigger lips, this is a non-invasive way to do it, so you don't have to get lip fillers. So this is, I love this stuff. I wear it every night, and I just go ahead and leave it on for um, 20 to 30 minutes until I feel like it's kind of sunk into my lips, and then I put the lip balm over it. I still have some lip balms left. The unicorn of Cenogens, because people want it so bad. Like, it sells out so fast. If you've been on the Quadruple the, Ki Quadruple the Kisses page, people fight over this stuff. But I still have some, if you guys are um, interested. So I have all of those extras available as well. Um, so yeah, those are all my swatches for you today. Remember, tomorrow's the last day to get 15% off of your entire order. And, um... Yes, uh, my last, my final um, little topic of discussion today is that I want you guys to make this, like, I want you guys to feel free to make this group your own. Like, I don't have to be the only one that posts. If you guys want to post selfies of you wearing the products or anything, like, go ahead and post. Um, if you want to ask questions, go ahead and post a question. Like, make this group your own. You can post anything you want. You find something funny, go ahead and post it. Like, it just doesn't have to be me. Calm down. My um, mom will also post sometimes because she's like my little business partner. If you ever have questions, you can also um, message her if you'd rather message her um, because, yeah, she helps me. We're together, like, all the time. So either you can message either one of us. Um, so, yeah, just go ahead and post on this page if you feel like it. Um... As I always say, thank you guys for watching. If you want to see other videos, you can go ahead and look at my sponsor's group. Her group is Quadruple the Kisses. I'm getting so much better at saying that. So proud of myself. And you can go ahead and join her group if you'd like. Okay, one more thing about making this group your own. This is such a mess. Okay, this group is public. So you can go ahead and you can share this group if, like, I hope you guys enjoy it. You can go ahead and share it. Um, you can... If you have any recommendations for what I can do to make this group better, you can go ahead and let me know as well. And you can add anyone you would like to the group. There's a little button that says, like, add members. Feel free to add your friends or anyone that you think might be interested. Okay, that is it now. So if you want to go ahead and um, join her group, go ahead. Back to that little section. So, yeah, you can join her group if you'd like. Um, but, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great day. Bye.